first started making this RC plane around Thanksgiving, and, <coughs> and it was really awesome and fun learning experience, and I learned so much about engineering, and I want to be an engineer someday. Yes. But I was going to make a build video, but I've only got 238 subscribers. This was the first version of it after I basically right after I finished it and it's got wheels made out of foam board, no paint. There we go. Then this was our first actual flight and the propeller came off. Then it was time for the next flight and oh. Now, I've added all the fancy stuff to make it look all fancy, and we're at my friend Abe's house. Um, he doesn't want his name or face on YouTube. So my grandpa gave me two actual landing gear wheels, so we can taxi a lot better. Here, we're trying to do some touch and goes. That didn't sound good. So now I took a break. Look at him, meow meow. Meow meow. Flamethrower. What do you have to say for yourself? It's gonna fly. Yes. We moved the gear up. More towards the nose. Does the CG center of gravity seem good? Yes. Probably take these headphones off. So you might have noticed we're ground moving a lot. At the moment, we were just using a little popsicle stick. <laughs> so this is Babe's plane. It's an Aero Scout. Would you let me fly it? Alright, we're back out here to do more test flights with plane. And there's beep behind the camera. What did you say about me? My orc. Oh, look at the horses. Aww. But we've got our new tailwheel. Oh, it steers nice. There's our tailwheel. It's steerable now. Oh, it's just in the Yeah, I got this on camera. What the time? What's it in the air? Oops. Dang it! Woo! 
punch it out of there. Okay, so beep, and I trimmed the wings down about half the length of the extensions. Oh, it saved it. So now we're testing his plane oh. that doesn't really know how to fly. Maybe get out of the way of the camera a little bit. I don't know. It was a super cheap $100 WL Toys little J3 cub, and it it looks awesome. There's size comparison, but I don't think it knows how to fly. There you go, there you go. Don't. Oh! Yay! Yeah. Is it out of battery again? Hey, what are you doing? Ah! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Ow! Wait. Hold on, Cam. What am I doing, Mama? Ah! This isn't going to end well. Oh, nice. Nope, nope. Whoa, whoa. Woo. Oh. Ah. Did you break it? What? Yeah, Did I kind of had a knee spasm and kicked the vertical stabilizer off. Nice. That's awesome. Yeah, this is going to fly. It's going to fly. I can feel it. So then we went to his friend's house and he didn't want us to record there but we did some major testing and figured out that it was extremely prone to tip stalls. So basically not vertical stalls but horizontal and it was also basically lost its dihedral because there was no permanent thing keeping it in there. And then so my grandpa made me this new wing and it looks so awesome and it has a proper airfoil. And oh look, he's buddy. And dihedral. And here's me taxiing. And it taxis so well in your ass now. And so we're about ready to test it. So what happened was the solder on the motor wires broke. That's the only downside of these cheap $20 Amazon But now, we're ready to test it on this basketball court. And it's actually real nice on here. Alright, flight number one. Oh, no, no, not quite. Flight number two. It's got a three channel setup because we're just testing the wing before we put the ailerons on, so it's a little... He's flying. He's flying. Oh my god, he's flying. Oh, 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 oh.
Yep. Okay. Now this time, I never had a camera person, but we've got everything fixed and we've got some brand new propellers that don't break nearly as easily. The engine exploded! Mayday! Mayday! I thought the motor exploded, but it was just the screws that vibrated out from all the crashes. <laughs>